Well, good evening, everyone, and welcome once again to my YouTube channel. This is Marty the Mad Magpie back again, and uh, coming on tonight um, to uh, not not to talk about football as such, but um, uh, about something which has uh, surfaced in the last couple of days, which has uh, has caused absolute great embarrassment um, to both Newcastle United and Sunderland Football Club. And uh, the disrespect shown for these two football clubs and legends of the clubs and the game as well. But before we go any further, guys, if you want to see more of Marty the Mad Magpie, then you're more than welcome to subscribe to my YouTube channel. It'll be great to have you on board. And if you like the video, please give us a like. It'll be greatly appreciated by myself. It's... Uh, Wonderful to have people watching and uh, at the end of the show as well if you want to leave a comment on the subject then you're more than welcome as well. I would be grateful and pleased to hear your views on the matter and the matter in question is what surfaced a couple of days ago but hit the national newspapers today and it already hit the, the North East News and North East papers and that was a couple of yobs and that is what I am going to call them yobs. Right, they are absolute scum of the earth, these people. And uh, a picture, in fact, it wasn't a picture, ladies and gentlemen. It was a fucking video. You know, somebody videoing another supporter, Newcastle United fan, I might add. Urinate. No, hang on, I'm going to use the word. I'm not going to be posh. I'm going to use it. He was pissing, get it right, pissing on the statue of Bob Stoko at the Sunderland Stadium of Light. Now, that is absolutely not just disrespectful, it is absolutely disgusting, and it is sick. Absolutely sick. I'm not going to name the bastard. He knows who he is. These people know who they are. It is absolutely disrespectful and disgusting doing that. It is absolutely awful. And, you know, I can only apologise from Newcastle United's point of view that we have these sort of people in our ranks. It is absolutely terrible. And apologies to Sunderland Football Club for this. You know, because it's absolutely... I, I keep saying the word... I keep saying the word disgusting and sick because that is exactly what it is. You know, actually, what they've actually done is turned up with the uh, intent... On doing this to that statue, defacing it. It's absolutely ridiculous. You know, turning up and pissing on a legend statue. A legend, I might add, ladies and gentlemen. It was a legend of both football clubs, Sunderland and Newcastle United. Yes, won the FA Cup with Sunderland in 1973. A brilliant achievement by the great man himself, Bob Stoke. But they want these fans. Have they not done their bloody homework? The bloody numbskulls, the fucking idiots. Have they not done their homework? He was a Newcastle United player. He played for Newcastle United in the 50s. And if I'm not mistaken, he was part of the 55. The 55 FA Cup winning team. Honestly, it just really gets to me that people can do this. You know, I mean, I don't class the right... It's a rivalry we have with Sunderland. And you, I'm sure you guys, Newcastle and Sunderland fans alike, will agree with this. It's, it's, it's a rivalry. It's not a hatred. It's, it's absolutely unbelievable. And what annoys me is, <coughs> is that he was videoed... Pissing on the statue and shouting, We're in Sunderland, we're in Sunderland, we're in Sunderland. Oh my God. Do you know, even if they'd done a video of him pissing up against the stadium wall, that is still wrong. It is disrespectful, it is sick, and it is absolutely an embarrassment to call themselves Newcastle United fans. They are not fans of Newcastle United. They don't even belong to Newcastle United. We do not Want those people and that particular guy who took a piss. But even worse than the guy who was videoing him. We do not want you guys in our fan base. You are a disgrace. You are sick people. And I understand that the man in question who was pissing on the statue has been arrested. And I would throw the book at him. Never mind community service. Never mind probation or whatever. I would chuck the book at him. A custodial sentence this guy should get. 
because it's absolutely, do you know, it's the lowest of the low. It's, it, it is, he might as just as well have pissed on somebody's gravestone because it is absolute, absolute sickness to do that. And it really has got to me, guys, tonight. It's, oh, and I, like I say, on behalf of Newcastle United supporters around the world, apologies for this scum who do this. And apologies to Sunderland Football Club in particular. I'm sorry that we have such sick, sick mutants like this within the club's fan base. Cannot apologise enough. And I know people will be saying, Marty the Mad Magpie, you shouldn't have to be apologising for these scumbags. But it really got to me when I seen that footage. Oh, actually, a friend of mine actually showed me the footage. And I says to him, I says, turn it off. I says, I'm going to be sick. That is absolutely despicable. Um, and it really has got to me, guys. And, uh, and you know, that's that's why I've come on tonight. To voice my opinion on it, on these sick, sick mutants. They're not even people. Because people don't do that sort of thing. In fact, it's an insult of mutants. Honestly, it is. They're just absolutely sick bastards. That is what they are. And I hope they get the book thrown at them. I do, honestly. Any judges tonight watching, you get him up in your court, throw the book at the bastard. Because he's a sick, sick mutant. And deserves to be punished. Okay, guys. Well, I'm going to wrap it up there. And sorry I've had to come on and voice my concerns on this matter. But it has got to me. And I had to get me uh, off my chest. But like I say, if you want to see more of Marty the Mad Magpie. <coughs> excuse me. Got a tickle in my throat there. Then you're more than welcome to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just hit the subscribe button at the bottom of the screen and uh, if you like the video or you like any of my videos then feel free to give us a like it would be great to have you on board as well you know and give us a, drop us a text as well guys in the comments box what do you make of the whole thing you know what is your opinion on it let me know guys it would be great to hear from you Newcastle United and Sunderland supporters alike let me know what you think okay so I'm going to wrap it up there, guys, and uh, do apologise for the colourful choice of language tonight, but that's the way it's felt today, OK? So I'm going to wrap it up there, guys, but thank you once again for tuning in, and I'll catch up with you all soon. All the very best to you. Have a great evening, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye for now.